Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome, welcome, welcome back to another Thursday, which means it is time for another Naz Watches Rising of the Shield Day. The old boy. So, hmm. in the last episode, we got to see uh, Malty and the King get some comeuppance, but not the correct amount of comeuppance. In fact, it is entirely too little comeuppance for the amount of bullshit they pulled, but... Okay, then, at least they're stripped of power for now. Oh boy. Like, apparently in the, um, in the manga, the only reason they are alive is because killing them would literally cause a political shitstorm. And... And the queen doesn't, and the queen keeps them alive because it would cause, it would cause issues, like with the other countries. And... There, there's none of this, like, oh, I'd offer up my own life, da 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 But, and now Fumi is just like, no, kill him. Kill him dead. Do it now. Fuck, big murder death. But I guess, apparently, Japan just enjoys, you know, being cowards so much that in the anime they had to change it, which, all right then. But we've got, we've got three more episodes left. We've got three more episodes left, including this one. And I'm wondering where we're gonna go. I mean, maybe there's just gonna be a setup for a season two. I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't mind that. But let's see if they manage to kind of bounce back to how good this se this series was at the very start, shall we? In three, two, one, and go. CG wheels, re. Oh god damn it! That just that looks so bad. And that's a different Philo model than before. Or at the very least, it's being used incorrectly. That looks like absolute ass. Wake up, you sleepy bitch. Now Fumi's got their sleepy bitch disease. Wow, they got that done, like, real quick. Like... Like, think about, like, the amount of- the, the masonry required in that. Like, they had to actually- they go in and just, like, carve whole new things. Con congratulations then. God. That hourglass still looks like absolute ace. <gasps> I swear to God, if Raftalia becomes with just a big titty Onesan, I'm gonna be... I'm gonna be concerned. Hey! Will you allow them free will? Yes or no? <laughs> like... That's... Mm, that's the question. That's... That, that's on it... Mm. <laughs> And I wonder what the, uh, what, uh, Motoyasu and, and Ikutsuki and Ren all did. Will, will you, will you allow your minions, your party members, free control of their over their upgrades? Yes or no? Like, I imagine Motoyasu probably did it for multi, but, hmm. I mean... I imagine for Philo, probably don't want it, don't want her to do that, because she's, you know, a wee babby. But Raftalia's smart enough to know what she's doing. I don't know. I mean, assuming that's just not, like, an off offhand thing, that'd be a pretty cool uh, premise for an episode, actually. Like, Raftalia, uh, Raftalia, Nafumi deciding whether he wants to, whether he wants to, or whether he's even capable of trusting them to make their own level ups. I mean, it'd be pretty neat. Because, I mean, by the idea of, like, controlling it himself, like, he'll know exactly what they've got. But if they do it, then, of course, like, they'll be able to work with what they got. Ah, no, nah, they're probably not doing it, right? Oh shit, drop my... Oh! 
Oh no, is it the premise? Is 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 that the premise? Big stat boosts. Oh. It's because they got slave crests. It's because they got slave crests. That's going to be it, right? Does Melty's entire family just fucking love Philolios? Like, oh my god, these giant nerds. Big nerds. Uh, castle servants, we gotta clean up in the throne room. Bring the mop again. In fact, bring the squeegee too. I mean, it offered him the choice, like, in the menu. So I'm wondering if he, he just hit, like, auto level up. Or, like, let me choose the level up. Uh, like, I just didn't tell them. Like, he's, he's just hiding information, he's being a dick again. Well, now you can't leave, Nafumi. You're not allowed. So was the button grayed out and I just didn't notice it? What the hell is that instrument? What the hell? Just copy-paste. Oh yeah, he's going to do that thing with the queen, right? Yeah. Hey, why is she allowed here? Why... Why is Malty allowed in? She should be out back, like, sw like sweeping garbage. Like, for real, man. Oh good, we're doing this again. We're doing this again. Wow, Itsuki, you really... Mm, you really pick some winners there, Itsuki. Slit that man's throat. Slit that man's throat. Do it with the table for the table knife. Oh good, she's poisoning the pie. This is exactly the shit I said that she'd do. Like, leaving her alive just means she's going to try something stupid. Like, poisoning food. Can we stop going back to Fitoria? Oh shit. Be- be our, uh, mediator there, Queen.
Tell Mira what now? Oh my god, it's... It's a fucking fate. You didn't play your dipshit Vidya game there, my dude. Damn. I absolutely love that they, they legally have to fucking stop and correct themselves. Oh, Jesus. Like, that's something- I mean, this is something I'm just kind of like, mm, getting a little bit too video gamey for me there, fam. Like, the concept of just like, hey, there's just an XP zone. Of course they haven't. Of course they haven't. Did you expect anything different? Because he's the only competent one. He's got that big dick energy. But I thought the whole idea was that each hero deals with the waves in the separate countries. Like, I'm kind of confused on that one. Or, or, do, or do the waves scale with the amount of heroes in the, in the country? In that case, that makes the queen, uh, the queen, the king, an even bigger idiot. Really, everyone's just... Just all of the, the fighting's just... Like, you think it'd be contained to just the two of them. But like, nah, like, everyone's just... Oh, God. He's racist, so legally I can kill him. There you go. Uh, it's current year. Oh, they learn what curse shield is. I wonder if, if, if these guys learn how, what curse shield is, then I am honestly curious whether they'll take it or not, because they're just big dumb idiots. Okay. Well, that would have been useful. He said himself that he hasn't played the game. Like... <laughs> What? <laughs> First episode, he said he'd never played the game. Like, why would they ex why would they expect him to know this stuff by default? It's not like there's a goddamn manual.
And, yep, not video games. Video games. So, wait, so there was, there was a, a manual. Now Fumi just never read it. Wow. This is going actually about as well as I expected, not gonna lie. I mean, he's not wrong. They were sat there for all of five minutes. They were there for five minutes before, some, before they did something stupid. Like, it's like these people want to die. Best friends. Uh, Melty's mouth, uh, Philo's mouth seems to be melting a bit. Wait, so they've got different... <laughs> they've all got, they've all got different man. like the manuals aren't complete. What the hell? Like... Like, unless, like, they, they don't all work differently. In order to have the system, you had to know about it ahead of time. That... Oh my god, this is... <laughs> Oh my god, that's dumb. I just, I can't. My brain. My brain, ow. Like, I mean, I'm assuming that's how that works. In order to have the system, you have to know, it in the know about it in the first place. Gotta prepare to become the best waifu. Cause she's the only one capable of doing it, cause everyone else is a daughter. -oo. Shadow st Shadow Steel Shield. That's hmm. That's pretty hype right there. Oh, poor, poor Grandpa Blacksmith. Oh, no. I mean, it's not like he could have bought shields anyway. I mean... I mean, for real, like... Because he can't use any other weapon, but... Wait, 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 wait. He could actually pick those up. Thought? What if Nafumi dual-wielded? What if he just dual wielded shields? Oh, that could be so cool. Like just like in Dark Souls, CG birds, re. Like what if like CG building, re. What if uh, like that was? Oh no, it wasn't CG building. Oh, CG ocean, re. Well, at least the town you know has people in it again, even though it's still you know in shambles. That's a lot of graves. What was left of her?
Like, like, are they just living in, like, the rubble? I, like, I didn't see any tents or anything, like... You could rebuild their houses for a start. Like, that'd probably be, like, a, you know, like, a good beginning. Wait, 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 is that the Scythera? Is, is that the Scythe guy? I'm an adult! Yeah, no, oh wait, yeah, no, that's a scythe hero down there. Oh boy! It begins! Time for this- time for the dick swinging competition to begin. Oh, we're gonna go like three episodes less. I imagine like when they're at this level up area, he's probably gonna show up and be a problem, right? Raftalia, they're dead. They can't hear you. Just bring her back to Japan. She'll make a killing in the cosplay market. Like, I, I can't wait until we hit the end of this and they, and they reveal, Oh yeah, no, there's actually no way to send you home. You're here until the day you die. But they won't find happiness if you're not there. That's kind of how, you know, this whole thing works. I mean, Philo thinks she was her dad, basically. Oh, like that sibling, that sibling rivalry is like, that's great. Oh, oh God, that looks so bad. Oh, Jesus. Susie, like, they're hitting the level of stupid that is just completely, like, unbelievable now. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. All right, so... So all in all, I like this episode. I got I got some minor complaints though, so I'll get those done first. Like, okay, so first off, told you so. What did I say? For, for like when I said like last time when mine was like left alive, she's gonna cause an issue. She's gonna do something stupid, and luckily she got caught by Melty here. But like, what if she hadn't? What if she hadn't? Um, I feel like... I feel like, uh... Raftalia pulling a knife on that guy doesn't really fit with the characterization we've seen so far from the anime. Based on what I've been told of her characterization from the manga, it makes sense, because she's a lot more open to, you know, revenge killing. You know, like you should- like, you know, like every good Dodoru should be. Um, but here, she's just like, I'm gonna kill him, I'm gonna stab him! Like, right now, I'm gonna stab that man to death! And... If it was just like a brawl between Raftalia and that arm armored guy, then alright, ma it makes sense. Like, if you just cut back to it and they were just like throwing hands... Like, that would be- that makes sense. But like... Everyone... Everyone in that banquet... Started just like whipping out blades, like... Oh, it's so bad, why? That's disgusting. Of course they did. Of course they did.
Hey, and there's Scythe Man. Uh, he's gonna wind up being a villain, right? Like, that's the thing? Um, like, I mean, you can only have four heroes, right? I mean, and Glass is a fan hero, and she's a villain. Hmm. Um, okay, what was I saying? Yeah, so... Like, I, I feel like it's, it's kind of ridiculous that it's escalated to, like, everybody in that room trying to fight. I love how Philo was just at the freaking salad bar, just, like, eating everything. That, that was just adorable. Um... I'm also, like, not a giant fan of uh, the way the world building works as far as, like, the ancillary abilities of the th thing. It's like, this weapon copy ability, you're only, you can only use it if you knew you had it, you know? And I imagine probably the same thing for, like, the automatic crafting. Um, that's kind of dumb. That's kind of dumb, but I guess, like, it does explain, like... Why Nafumi had it so much harder than the other heroes, and now that he's kind of surpassed them, he gets he you know he can use the the things no issue. Um, that's pretty good, and it and it shows that there's some sort of psychosomatic thing as well, because like if they're all being like, oh, it's about the rarity, no, it's about the um, like the refinement, no, it's about the da 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 da, and these guys have been managing to like keep up and like basically make shit work means that they're all correct. They're all correct, but, like, in their own way, which means, possibly, that w power, the weapon power scaling is working uh, based on, like, what they believe from their games, which is a pretty neat, which is a pretty neat gimmick, as far as, you know, as far as that goes, but, like, the whole, like, oh, yeah, this whole weapon copy thing, to unlock, you have to know about it in the first place. Like, that's... That's kind of silly, the fact that, like, this, these things have a manual that just doesn't work. Um, other than that, I mean, really not a lot wrong here. Like, I mean, the guys are, like, the guys are big, stupid idiots, and they argue like pricks. Like, but, I mean, I've come to expect that by now. Like, even as much as I think, like, it's going to, it's getting to the part where it is beyond believability. I mean, at the same time, like, there is precedent in the story for them being this dumb. So, I mean, I guess that's fine. I guess this, I guess this, fine. Um, uh, other than that, I mean, other than that, though, like, this is a good-ass episode. Like, I mean, like, CG kind of ruined a lot of scenes, but pure story-wise, like, nah, fam. Like, the Queen and Melty, like, freaking marking out over the, um, over the Philolial Queen. Like, the, the start of the banquet before everything went tits up. Um, like, and... Just like a lot of world building happened here, like a lot, like like this is like another world building episode kind of thing, and I mean I imagine for like how everything has to change going forward because like the main story thrust has now changed from revenge to actually doing what you're supposed to, like, I, I yeah, but you you do kind of need that world building because the original world building only really served the revenge plot, like we had just enough information to kind of push Nafumi along. Along, along that path, and now we need more. So, at the very least, they're, they're expounding on it. I just hope they don't fuck it up, honestly. I, I, I mean, because I'm, I'm kind of scared, like, based on, like, the previous few episodes. Um, oh, they really need to stop with the CG, though. Like, holy shit, like, there's entire scenes that were just entirely CG here, and I'm really not a big fan of that. Like, oh, boy. Um, visiting Raftali is... Uh, Village is cute, though. Like, I, I did like that. Um, I don't know what I want to think about that Ar Arpeleg- Arpeleg- Arpelego. Fuck! Arpe- yeah, Arpelego. Um, like, it's- I mean, in concept, I mean, it serves as a catch-up mechanic. Like, it's put into the story so that the heroes can catch up to the point that they should have been by this point if they hadn't spent all this time arguing like assholes. But at the same time, from a world-building perspective, it's like- can a world really be this video gamey? Like, like a lot of stuff. I'm like, okay, no, it's like the shields are, uh, the shields are kind of translating like natural experience and all this into like stuff that these guys can understand because you know these guys are all like isekai protagonists and they ex and they ex uh, understand video games, right? Makes sense that the weapons are are doing that, but. The fact that, like, so much of these mechanics are just a thing, it's like, 
of course, like, the, the, they would know, like, the people in charge of it would know, like, hey, what does this look like from your end? So it's like, hey, yeah, you got, you got XP, you got a party, you got, like, here's your HUD, da 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 they probably had a hero draw it for them before so they know what's up. But, but at the same time, the way she was talking about, like, oh, once every ten years there's this big XP bonus on this island, da 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 like, that to me sounds like regular people take advantage of that, and that's kind of mm, that's kind of a mm, right there. I don't know about that, Chief. I don't know about that. Depending on how they on how they handle it and what context they give it, if they give it any context whatsoever, I would hope they do because the world building in this series is usually pretty good. Um, yeah, I would, I, I would, I would like a, I would like a little bit more of an explanation how some stuff works in this series. Not gonna lie. Um, but yeah, good episode, like, honestly, like, good episode, like, like, I don't, like, uh, literally, only problem I have is the copious amounts of computer, of computer-generated garbage, and that's roughly it, like, like, very minor, minor nitpicks other than that, um, yeah, it's good, it's good, it's good show, good show, I hope that it continues to get gooder, so it can be as good as it was in the first episode, oh boy. Anyway, let me know what you think down there in the comments. Whether you agree with me, disagree with me, or you want to bring up something I left out. But I, I think I got everything. I think. Um, yeah. And, uh, yeah. Then let me know down in the comments. <laughs> if you, if you were in a hero thing, what kind of weapon would you want? I've already established my, my love of gun no, oh, sorry, or tate no gun. <laughs> like that, so that'd be, that'd be me on that one. Oh boy, wouldn't be able to use the weapon copy ability, but who cares, I'd have a gun. Um, yeah, let me know what, what weapon you would want down there. And how you think Spe uh, Scythe Hero is gonna, is gonna cut out, because it's like, I mean, he's very clearly a bad guy, right? Like, Scythe, like, okay, like, I probably should talk about this more, but Scythe Hero. Like, like man, we got some shots of him in the opening, which means he's probably gonna get into a fight this, this season. But it's like, you got the four Cardinal Heroes... I mean, okay, it doesn't, like, we, can, we don't actually get to see who he's fighting. That's interesting. Um, but yeah, so, like, so this is one of two things. Either the other nations have started summoning their own heroes, like, basically they found, like, other cardinal weapons that they're looking for, or, you know, the anti-heroes, like, glass, are... They're, they're not just around during the waves. They're actively walking around Melloramark and everything doing, like, anti-hero stuff. And, I mean, hey, that's entirely possible. I, I mean, I think it would be cool if the other countries started, like, summoning their own, like, ancillary heroes. But that would require, like, a big rewrite of the established lore. And, hmm, I don't know if I would like that, to be honest. But yeah, I don't know. Let me, let me know what you think he's about as well. Um... But yeah, as always, everybody, I am Nozovix. Remember to like, comment, favorite, subscribe, share on social media, tell your friends, hit that share button down below. And if you want, you can always support me on Patreon, which is linked down in the description, and uh, on my end card, along with some of my other videos, if you want to see those, if you're not quite sure you want to do that yet. Oh, boy. Um, and if you support me on Patreon, then you get access to a patrons-only Discord channel on the open Discord server that anyone can join, which is linked down there as well. Um, and from there, you can recommend things to be Let's Played, live streamed let's watch whatever kind of content i do oh boy and we have our patrons only movie night that we do once a month uh should be doing uh the one for june next week and that's gonna be it's gonna be right there um and we just kind of hang out like all day basically i sit in discord all day with, the, with, with my rabbit open and people can drop in drop out watch some shows maybe watch an anime maybe play some video games if someone if someone if someone's down so it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of lot of big fun. Uh, but yeah. Oh boy. So I'll see you in the next video. But most importantly of all, become a trash mammal today. And I'll see you a round yeah, you're gonna take my nigga like this from the kids that like him up a night. Who did I get last night? I got the new face, I can't survive. I don't